Hi everyone, it is Kato. As you probably know already, I am making journals for my custom bridles. The journal includes the customization progress, but there are many empty pages so the new owner can continue the story of the duel. This time I am using this drawing pot from Arteza as the base of the journal. For the decoration I will need a glue stick, ink, stamps, colored pens, washi tapes and some other things as well. To cover the cover I am using this textured paper, but first I will tape a simple white paper to get more coverage. Each of my journals is different a bit. I usually have vertical journals, so this one will be my first horizontal journal. Each of my journals includes a photo of the doll on the cover. Here you can see how I make this part of the decoration this time. Of course, butterflies are must-haves. The next step is printing the photos. Then I am using a cutting board, a knife and a ruler to cut the excess paper off from the photos. I always send off a little bit the edges, so the photos get a vintage style, especially if I pair them with coffee dyed paper. I 
I don't use scissors to cut down the text which I will add to my journals. I am using paper glue to stick the text and the dyed paper into the journal. For the photos I usually use double-sided tape and I am adding washi tape as a decoration. I have some Stemperia stamps which I really like to use. For coloring I am using different things like watercolor pencils, fine liners and brush pens. This artisan draw pad is very good because the pages are not too thin, so the colors are not transferring into the other side of the paper. This is the finished journal of Maple. I listed the tools which I used at the journal in the description box below. Thank you for watching, see you next time, bye!